Hello everyone! Look at all these things! Oh my goodness. And while I was prepping for this, I noticed a few Christmas presents too. Because that's how long it's been since I've filmed a PR haul. It probably doesn't even feel like that long, so I feel like time's just flying right now. But yeah, we've got some Christmas gifts, new makeup releases, a bunch of clothing it looks like as well. So I'm just going to dive in. You guys know the drill. Check the down bar. There's going to be some giveaways. All the information will be in the down bar. I sent out like eight boxes for my last giveaway and... Yeah, it felt good to get rid of some of it and share share the love. We also donated a butt ton, like literally like huge boxes. So same thing goes this time. You guys know me. I'm going to keep my absolute favorites, the stuff that I want to use in my next video, which is going to be a full face of first impressions for you guys. So get excited for that. And everything else is going to go to you guys and donated because I don't need all of this. There's so much. How exciting. Ah, oh, time to get comfortable. First of all, we've got this giant box from White Fox Boutique. I swear to God about six of these have, like, come in this, like, time frame that we're showing. You know what I mean. Oh my gosh. It's the end of the day, you guys. I've been filming all day and working all day and it's already three o'clock and I'm just sitting down to film this now. So, like, my brain cells are on, like, the down low right now. Hopefully it'll perk up shortly. I've got my got my coffee up there. All right, so this is packaged so pretty. Am I too like low? I feel like I'm really short. Okay. Oh, it says, hey Shannon, we can't wait for you to get your hands on our new holiday collection. I hope you love them as much as we do. Thank you, White Fox. You guys know I love White Fox Boutique. It's one of my favorite brands. Okay. <gasps> cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is a cute little strapless mesh kind of dress. It's gonna be hard for you guys to see on camera, but it's like got like the nude lining and then the mesh vibes. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. I need to find somewhere to wear this. I need to like go on a spontaneous girls night out I think because like I literally don't go clubbing but that's the cutest clubbing dress I've ever freaking seen. Oh that's so cute. Maybe I should just have like a random like photo shoot in my bedroom and just like upload cute pictures to Instagram. I don't know. <laughs> oh my god this is so up my alley. Yes. Look. Bustier. My favorite ones are from White Fox. I've got cute white ones, pink ones, neon ones, like all sorts of different ones. And my favorite are from this website. They are so cute. So it's hard to show you black stuff, isn't it? It's got a zip up the back and it's a velvet. These look so bomb. They make you look like friggin' hourglass. Look at this one. What the heck? Oh my god, it's silver. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited to try these on. How much did they send me? So nice of them. And these are all in a size large, which is perfect. I'm usually a size large because of the tatas. Um, and dresses definitely a size large. I'm like a size like 10 up top usually, unless it's really tight on the boobs. And then like a 12 down below. Look at this dress. It's got like sequin straps on it. Oh my gosh. I'm just going to go kind of quick because there's so much stuff. That's really cute. Like corset kind of style. And then... Oh my gosh, I've got a similar dress to this from White Force Boutique already, but in black. And then, okay, here is a black one. It's a little bit different to my one. If you guys saw my clothing, like, it would have been one of my last clothing hauls, which was literally months ago. I don't know why I don't film them anymore, but I really need to. I think I've just been, like, super stressed and... I don't know, like, for some reason, clothing hauls just stress me out. I think because people are so critical, you know? And then we've got this silver dress. This is so 2000s, like Paris Hilton. Okay, literally, if they just sent me, like, one of everything, there's this one too, which is black and velvet, the same style. And then last but not least, this velvet, like, knotted at the front. It's like a little cutout style with an exposed zip. Velvet with the straps. Oh my gosh. How cute! Okay, if you're looking for like cute night out outfits, then you know where to go. <laughs> There's more. I might like look at some makeup in between. Look. Bustier. Is that, is that Bustier? Bustier? I don't know. This one's white. Oh my god, so cute! If only I was still friggin' going to music festivals this year, but everything keeps getting cancelled because of COVID, which is responsible. I mean, I shouldn't, like, I mean, I can't travel outside New Zealand, but I don't think I'd want to yet anyway. Um. Not until there's like vaccines and stuff. Okay, I'm assuming this is like some more like dresses and tops and things. But yeah, there's so much new stuff. Holy moly. Thank you guys so much, White Fox. Usually I just go on there and freaking buy my own stuff. Because like I always shop on there with my own money. But so thankful. I'm excited to open this one. Kisses by Hershey's. So this is a collaboration with Etude House. Which is a key beauty brand which I really like. How do I open it? It's so cute. Okay, it's an outer sleeve. And then it opens. 
da, da, da. It looks like this. Ouch, my thumbnail. So inside, look at what we have here. Hershey's Kisses Choco Mousse Tint. We have Kisses Brush. Okay, the little makeup brushes. We have um, three different eye palettes. So Special Dark, Almond Chocolate, and Milk Chocolate. Oh my god, it's actually got like the little Hershey's Kiss tag. How bloody cute is that? And inside, oh my god, the mirror is huge. Look. And it comes with four little eyeshadows. So cute. Oh, and a makeup pouch. <laughs> Stop. Isn't that so cute? I feel like I should give this to Sally. Because Sally would love that. Special dark. I just want to see what the other lip oh, combos look like. It's like a pinkier neutral. And then milk chocolate is just like pure neutrals. Very pretty. And then these. What do they look like? Oh, pretty. Okay, so it's like a yeah, moussey tint lip color. I feel like I want to share some with Sally because I feel like she'll like them. <laughs> They're so cute. I've kept some for myself too. So thank you so much Etude House. That's such a cute collection you guys. Oh my gosh. What's in here? Shannon. What a fancy look. Every time I see this kind of like closing on I'm like yeah that's fancy. Where's this from? 18 months, 2 trains, 6 planes, 10 automobiles. Jakarta is far. 937 Zoom calls, 131 days in quarantine, 22 cases of Prosecco, 34 sample rounds, 2 dogs, 14 unique sets of lashes, and we're finally here. We're beyond excited to introduce the Love Scene, a brand new brand of lashes. We hope you love them as much as we do. Never not faking it, Jenna and Troy. That's such, like, that's so cute. Okay, this is flash. It's wrapped up like this. And then inside, this is how the lashes look. Cute packaging. Um, real natural style here. These ones are called Jack. Synthetic lashes, never tested on animals. These ones are really pretty. Nor, I like the look of those ones. And then these ones are like a brown and black blend called Romy. And then there's more stuff here. Oh, it's like a reusable bag. How cute is that? I seem to have gotten sent heaps of Dragon Beauty all of a sudden. We have the color correctors here in green, lavender, and orange. Probably donate these. I don't think I'll have like that much use for them to be fair, like on my skin. And I feel like I've found a green corrector that I really love. And it is a K-Beauty brand. I'll link the video where I tried it down below. And there's more. So in here says Dragon Glass. I don't know, there's heaps of different stuff. We have lip job liners, which I'm so keen to try. You guys know how much I love lip pencils. Little pencil sharpener, which is always handy. And then a whole lot of liquid lipstick. So if you're like keen to see me try them, let me know. And there's more. Dragon Beauty is the bad the baddest of them all. I think this is the little eyeshadow palettes, which I've never tried. We've got liquid eyeliner as well. Blackout and teddy bear. So this is Fantasy Palette Volume 2. Looks like this. And then Fantasy Palette Volume 1 with these beautiful like purpley tones. Reminds me of the Heaps of Sweets palette, like those vibes, which clearly I love. And some more, which I think are just some more liquid lipsticks. By the way, these all did come in the same like package that was in all these mini boxes but yeah there we go do you guys want a lip swatch video like is that a legit idea or not maybelline oh new lip glosses and lipsticks i think cream to powder eyes oh no eyeshadow pens okay with matching lip glosses that's such a cool little um PR package gloss with hyaluronic acid and then the color strikes are easy cushion tips with no fallout with 12 hour wear Cool. Oh my gosh, I'm kind of keen to try those. I might just keep them in the box like that so I can like, you know, mix and match. And we have some new Ofra stuff. I'm a huge fan of Ofra. And I've really enjoyed playing with like new Ofra stuff lately. As you guys have probably picked up. But hey, this is a new mini mix. And it is $39 with a $109 value. So it's called Good To Go. And there's some really nice like blush bronze eyeshadow colors and a highlighter. Honestly, their powders are underrated. They're such good quality. We have a mini makeup fixer trio. Blemish treatment cream, a moisturizing blemish spot healer. It's got benzoyl peroxide, rosemary oil, blemish causing bacteria zapped from the skin, helping to reduce breakouts. This lightweight gel-like hydrator avoids dry out caused by blemish fighting ingredients and can be worn prior to foundation and it pairs well with our blemish treatment mask for those breakouts, they won't quit. Interesting, maybe I'll keep that near all my makeup for when I've got like some hormonal acne, I can pop it on before my primer. 
we have some more liquid eyeliner. I really like that. Heaps of stuff in here. Yes. I needed some more of this brush disinfectant spray. As always, there's like a million different um, ColourPop collections. A novel romance. So this is monochromatic metallic palettes. There's also lashes in here and a couple of brushes. So yeah, there's five different ones. They all look ooh, like this. I'm just going to open one random one and we'll see the vibe. Which one? Maybe this one. This is Amour. Oh, cute. So the packaging looks like this. And then, obviously you can see through it, but it looks like that. How cute is that? Next up, some Mecca goodies. And there is a note here that says Shannon on it. It says here, Dear Shannon, wishing you an incredibly Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Thank you so much for your support and what has been an interesting year. We are so looking forward to working with you in 2021. Hope you enjoy these beautiful bowls that have been handcrafted by local Auckland artist Matt Hall. With love, the Mecca PI and Influencer team. So nice. Let's have a look. They're all wrapped in the Mecca um, paper. Cute. Oh my god, they look like jelly. A yellow one. Oh my god, I vibe these. I'm going to take them to my beach house. These would be so cute for like serving nuts and berries and stuff out of. Oh my god, they're so cool. Gosh, and they're signed. How cute. I love this color. This is my favorite one. Thank you so much, Mecca. That's so thoughtful. Do you know what, like, my dream item of homewares is that I'm still looking for is, you know, like, bottle green, how you can buy, like, bottle green glasses and things? Like, I really want a set of bottle green glasses. Like, with these kind of vibes, the green color. I need to figure out where I can buy them from. We have another Mecca package. There's a whole lot of their new releases. Yes, I literally just bought heaps of stuff off Mecca last night. <laughs> Because I was like stocking up on stuff that I like and for my wedding and stuff like waterproof mascara I was like should I better like buy some waterproof mascara because I donate all of mine because I don't use waterproof normally Because I hate like trying to get it off but for my wedding day I'm like oh I might need it So first of all we have the tinted moisturizer skin balm by Stila which sounds so interesting Multi-use skincare and makeup blend It looks like that shade 2 I have to try it I wonder what it's like like is it literally just I'm gonna touch it yeah, it feels like a balm. It's got a little bit of coverage. That looks really pale. I have to try one. I've got like less fake tan on. But I'll put it in my drawer. So we'll try it at some stage. Oh my god, yes. I've been wanting to try this. This is the Urban Decay Stay Naked Hydromaniac Tinted Glow Hydrator. It's like a tinted moisturizer. There's a few different shades in here. Yay! Oh my gosh. Okay, they've given me like an ultra fair one. Which is probably going to be way too light. But we also have fair and light. So I'll probably be light because I think I usually wear like 30 to 40 in their range. So we'll see. What is this? Urban Decay All Night Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. But it's red. Why is it red? Is it just like a limited edition one? I don't know. But it's red. One Step Correct Kitten. I saw this because I was going to buy it. But then I couldn't figure out if it was actually new or if it's like the same as the one that I always used to rave about just in like new packaging, new name, whatever. It's like the same looking packaging, but do you know what I mean? I don't know, I'll have to try it. But I'm stoked either way, because it's one of my holy grails. New Lily Lashes, new styles, I guess. We've got Melbourne, oh, they're both Melbourne. Talica Paris Liposils Mascara, Makeup and Care, Lash Growth Mascara. Hmm. Summer Fridays Cloud Dew Oil Free Gel Cream. Do you know what? I've been obsessed with the moisturizer Mecca sent me last time. I just repurchased it. It was like $115. And it is the Summer... No. Sunday Riley. Is that the brand? Sunday Riley Vitamin C one. The one in the orange container. Anyways. This one is an ultra lightweight gel cream that infuses thirsty skin with three types of hyaluronic acid and ceramides. That sounds luxurious. Click and Glow Tan Drops. On the, on the go tanning and also gradual tan high h2o hydrating mousse that sounds nice one step correct eye brightening serum oh my god stop I st oh, you guys oh my god i'm so excited to try that oh hell yeah and then lastly some light self tanning drops by Isla Paradise I had the blue color whatever that means I think it might be medium and they are really good so there you go at the moment I'm using the San Tropez spray on one which I actually love and then lastly something in here Celestial Rose Cream Tammy Fender Holistic Skincare Precious Rose and Manuka Honey Sue Skin rich in essential micronutrients providing deep hydration and a protective veil from environmental stresses it's all skin types the number one ingredient in it is aloe leaf juice. Ooh, nice ingredients. We have Huda Beauty 
the Wishful Thirst Trap Juice, HA3 and Peptide Serum, Hyaluronic Acid, Aloe Vera and Hollyhock Rose. It's a serum for your skin. I feel like, did I already get sent this? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know. I love the packaging. I wanted to show these because I was asking where I could find cute bikinis for New Year's and then this girl contacted me with her small business and wanted to send me some and I was so excited because they looked beautiful, right? But they didn't friggin' arrive in time because the couriers are just so shitty. Um, it wasn't her fault, but I thought I'd just show you in this video regardless. So these are from Venom Collection. Check her out if you're looking for bathing suits. It's about like that. Hi Shannon, we absolutely cannot wait to see you in our sustainable bikinis. We hope you have a wonderful Xmas holiday. Lots of love, Venom. <gasps> I'm so sad. They're very body confident. They are very sustainable, like, um, you know, with their packaging. Like, even this. Compostables are a waste and everything. So, I think these are reversible too. This is like a Brazilian, like, under underwear. Like, you go in and out. And then the top as well is just the same, so you can wear it both ways, which is so cute. You're nice with a fake tan as well, like that peach colour. This one's bomb, look at this. Like hot pink, and then leopard print on the other side. And then the bottom is like the super strappy one, which I love. And then we have this soft pink inner with the reptile. And then the top is like a bandeau, which actually has an underwire too. And then last but not least is just a leopard print one which is so cute i love leopard print and i love the style of these bottoms they're like a higher waist kind of cheeky cut next start with something from fate jewelry which was sent to my PO box hi shannon my name is vanilla and i am the owner of fate jewelry i began this small business in january and would love to share some of our earrings with you these are our silver snakes and soon to be released tree dangles i hope you like them have a safe and happy christmas Thank you so much. So you can shop at Fate Jewelry NZ, um, FateJewelryNZ.BigCartel.com. Oh, cute little Christmas tree earrings. Dang it, those would have been so cute for Christmas. And then these snake ones are so cool. How cute are those? Also got sent some bites. So this is a new mascara. It is the Upswing Full Volume Mascara. Have to give it a go. And then we have a Flower Power Collection by Colourpop. Lashes, a palette the stuff here i'll show you the pressed powder palette oh my gosh cute it's like a matte palette of burnt oranges real pretty colors and heaps of lippy pencils which i mean oh my gosh and lippy sticks throwback i might keep some i don't know you'll probably see them in my next video if anything this is the new packaging for the lippy sticks look that's cool i love these that's the reason i fell in love with ColourPop from the start the lippy sticks we have more Huda Beauty stuff. Oh, it's their um, faux filter foundation, but they've made it, I think, like, upgraded it and removed the scents and everything, so I'm so excited to give it another go. I used to love it, but the scent did kind of put me off. I don't know if it really irritated my skin at all or broke me out, but I was kind of, like, ugh, nervous about it because it was so strong. So they've sent me some new shades. Stoked. I'm so excited to see that. And it's called Luminous Matte now. Is that different to what it used to be called? Even improved formula, 24 hour wear, non drying, fragrance free, non comedogenic, life proof, Dubai proof, which is like, you know, humidity, sweat proof, super long wear, pool party proof. So yeah, heaps different shades too, which is awesome to see. That's so cool. Okay, yeah, Keen. And it says it's mask proof too. Oh, I can tell I'm getting old because now like when I sit on my butt like this, my legs get all sore. Next up we have some... Urban Decay Little Palettes. This one is called Soundtrack Zero Zeros, like 2000s eyeshadow palette. And it looks like this. I love the chain vibe. And we also have 70s, which has these types of shades just here. We have 80s, which is way more bright, which is quite fun. And then we also have the 90s, which... I like those grungy kind of tones. And oh my god, the iconic like light blue. <laughs> oh, I'm excited for this one. Jar Cosmetics. Congratulations, Jar. I'm so excited for this. So inside, we have a whole lot of pigments and eye brushes and stuff like that too. So it says here, hey gal, thanks so much for trying out my new line of cosmetics. I've included the full collection. I hope you find some new favorites. Here's to 2021 from Jar. That's Jar there. She's a sweetie. Love her. We became friends way back, back when I was newish to youtube and she was new and yeah i've always appreciated her talent so 
these brushes are for cut creases and like detail art, eye art. And then there's heaps and heaps of pigments. So I'm gonna go through these off camera and just like pick my favorites. But oh my God, like straight away, look at that color. It's like a soft pinky champagne, like literally right up my alley if you know me. So we'll definitely be trying some of these. Dun, dun. Something else here from BH Cosmetics travel series i think it's just a brush set is it? oh no there's something else so there's a brush set here which looks like this down the bottom and ooh, aspen oh, highlight palettes colorful highlight palettes so fun and los angeles which is a eyeshadow palette how cute is that all right we've got something here from luna and rose which is a new path and jewelry creation. A little bag here. Thank you for supporting our sustainable and maintainable business. All of our pieces are crafted with an obsessive attention to detail and a deep rooted passion of keeping artisan culture alive in our island home of Bali. All of our pieces are made from recycled sterling silver, organic cotton, and dyed with plants. Cool. Okay, the packaging, first impression wise, is so stunning. Oh, that's really cute. Oh my gosh, it's like a little pendant. Can you see that? It's really pretty. It's like a little lion or something, I think. And then the second piece is another pendant. What is that? I can't tell. He guesses. It's some kind of like people. I don't know. Is it religious? I'm not too sure. Two people next to like a tree? I don't know. Does it say in this? Don't mind Louis just like plodding along in the back. St. Francis of Assisi. The patron saint of animals and environment. That's cute. Oh, there you go. And then we have the new Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Freeze, which I'm very hyped to try. It's supposed to give you those like soap brow looked, 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 looking at brows. Also some more lip glosses and a new highlighter. This is called Honey Diamond and Glass. And then the highlighter is Iced Out. And it looks like this. It's like white with a... a gold kind of reflect to it. And then we have something new here from... Uh, zit sticker which I really like this brand they also sent some little like stickers that you put on active pimples you know like pussy looking pimples and I've tried them and I really like them they actually work to like draw out all the pus I don't know how it works but it works anyways um I'll show them in like an upcoming empties video because I've pretty much used them all this is the press refresh um what is this hydrogel exfoliating sheet mask to soothe breakouts unclog pores and smooth uneven texture maybe I'll try this like on Monday or something before my wedding. I feel like that'd be like a nice like few days before the wedding kind of mask. Some new Ulta 3 makeup. We've got brow stylers here. We've got set and stay brow pencils here. And then this fluff and fix it soap brow compact. So a cheaper alternative to perhaps like the Anastasia Beverly Hills one. And then we have some brand new Mellow. Look at this patch, it's so pretty. They all look stunning. Mineral eyeliners. Are these liquid or pencil? New pencil eyeliners. And then they've done some quad eyeshadow palettes. I'll just show one random one. This is Aphrodite. Is that how you say it? Nice packaging. Looks like this. And then on the inside, stunning. Those look so luxurious. Something else that was sent to my pair box. This is from Dainty Creation at dainty.creation on Instagram. It's a small business. Shanik, so hi, I hope you're keeping well. I've started a new business to help support my little family. I make bookmarks, key rings, and homeware by hand. I sent you one of my popular coaster sets and really do hope you like them. Be rest assured that all of our items were made with care whilst wearing gloves and masks throughout the whole process. I would love to hear your thoughts on our products. It mean a lot to our small business. This is a bookmark. This is stunning. Look how pretty that is. Oh my gosh, I love it. So nice. I might have to like re-gift this to my nan because I don't read books anymore like I do. Sorry. I use my Kindle so I don't need a bookmark but that would be such a nice one for her. And then let's look at the coasters. How cute. This is what they look like. Real pretty. Alright, Glow Lab. They sent some hand wash, which I've already put in the bathroom because we ran out of hand wash and I was ripping this PR haul and I was like, boom, done. Love it. Looks like this. It smells so good. Um, and I think you just get like countdown and stuff like that. And then they also sent some rose hip oil plus as well, which I already have heaps of, so pop that in the giveaway. Oh, another package from Ooh and Decay. This is the shade 40. There you go. Boom! Done and dusted. We have a package here from Laura Lee Los Angeles. Nudie number two. 
Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in here. Look, heaps of stuff in here. We have the brushes with the brush roll. Stunning, beautiful. A whole bunch of liquid lipsticks, which I want to try some. Put them in my drawer to open later. And then the Nudie 2 palette, which I will props do a tutorial using. Packaging so pretty. Looks like this on the inside. Stunning colors. Beautiful. And then there is the Nudie Patootie palette, which I'm pretty sure I already have, so maybe I'll give it to Sally or I'll put it in a giveaway. The reason I keep bringing up Sally is because I see her this week. I'm so excited I'm going up to stay with her, so I don't know. I might take her some makeup. <laughs> we have the Kylie Skin Lip Oil extra AF packaging for lip oil. I love lip oils though. I'm excited to try it. Um, it's just a clear one. Oh my god, I've like ripped my finger look. It's like low-key bleeding. Can you see that? Okay, this stuff I bought myself and I got it from Cult Beauty. This I already tried yesterday. It made my skin bomb. So I'm so excited to keep using it. It is the AHA and BHA peeling solution. Heaps of people have raved about this and I can see why it really just makes your skin feel and look so smooth and glowy and like my pores just looked way more refined. Um, I get bad congestion and so I'm really into like chemical exfoliants like that. They help so, so much. I bought the Airbrush Flawless Foundation by Charlotte Tilbury for my video that I'm gonna be, gonna be doing. Um, full face of Charlotte Tilbury coming soon. And I bought some Vive, which is um, Jamie Genevieve's brand so I just really wanted to try it and show my support. I also got this. I think Chloe Morello recommended this. This is the Dr. Jart Tiger Grass Color Correcting Treatment. I think it's some kind of like tinted product. I don't know. Once again we'll try it in a video. And then I also got the Acres Mix Foundation to try because I love the CC cream. It's what I'm wearing today. It's like a holy grail so I thought I would try out the liquid foundation. It says it improves bare skin in two weeks. It's meant to be skincare too. Who knows? Sounds like banter to me, but I do love it cosmetics products. Like I just feel like the formulas are so nice. So we'll give it a go. Oh, my legs. My legs. I'm going to have to start filming these in like three parts. I swear because oh, saw what is in here. Bondi Sands. Oh, they have a new like powder, drying powder for fake tanning. So you can chuck it on. If you like find it comes off on your armpits or on the back of your thighs or like the back of your knees or something, you can just chuck that on to like dry it in place. And they also sent some pajamas and the Aero Ultra Dark Foam, which I really like. This was sent by Mecca. It is a glow recipe little gift pack. So we have Dew drops, niacinamide dew drops, ultimate glow and brightening, watermelon highlighting serum, vegan, cruelty free, paraben free. On a no makeup day apply, one to two pumps is the last step of the entire routine. When wearing makeup, evenly distribute formula on fingertips and pat on the high points of the face in a tapping motion on top of makeup. For a glossy eye look, dab a pea sized amount to the center of the eyelid and blend out. Ooh. Or you can use it as primer. You could also mix it with your foundation too, it says. That's so cool. Let me open it. It looks like this. Cool packaging. And it's just like a gel. Can you even see? This lighting is so shit because it's so freaking sunny. It smells like watermelon. Niacinamide brightens the uneven skin tone and dullness and minimizes the appearance of pores. And there is also a mist and lip pop. Nourishing and smoothing. You can use this to set your makeup too. I love, love, love the idea of that. Oh, and there's one more thing. What's this? A moisturizer. Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturizer. Another ColourPop package. We have, oh my gosh, cute, look. Eye pencils. And then Fade Into Hue eyeshadow palette. Oh my gosh, I bet I'm going to like this. Oh, look at that. Hell yes, that's so beautiful. All these different tones, shimmers, glitters, and mattes. And all the colors of the rainbow. Something in here with my name on it. It's a scratchy. It says scratch me. Is this actually a scratchy? Can't scratch it. Oh, there we go. I got a little bit. Oh my god, why is this so hard? It says launching autumn. That was so much effort. <laughs> Alright, so it says here the circus tent. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, roll it, roll up. Hashtag the circus tent. Is that the brand? La Rock Pro? La Rock Pro. La Rock Cosmetics.com. Okay, oh my gosh, I'm, this is a whirlwind. Ugh. I'm cutting myself left, right, and center. Ooh, that's pretty. It reminds me of P. Louise. 
Look at that. Ridiculously bright. We have some Lux Fitness stuff. With a note, it says, Shannon, wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I have included our new limited edition gingerbread powder. Yum. So we have a shaker. Vanilla, which I love. White chocolate caramel. And gingerbread. Yum. I love Lux protein powders. I've been using them for years. I'm running out of room. <laughs> Another Glow Lab box. It says, hi Shannon, get that holiday glow. We have loved working with you this year and seeing the beautiful content that you've created with our products. We're so grateful for your support. As a small token of our appreciation, we have donated to White Ribbon New Zealand, a charity empowering women that is dear to our hearts on your behalf. That's so nice, thank you. And it says, we've also enclosed our mini pack, travel size products, perfect to take away, um, just like travel size stuff. I love when people wrap things so nicely like this. I wish I could do it. <laughs> and that's what it looks like. I love mini things. They're perfect for travel. Way more ColourPop stuff. This Hello Kitty thing. Oh my god. I'm going to take some of this to Sally. I have to. She loves Hello Kitty. Oh my god. Cute. Look at the blush. Oh my gosh. It's so sweet. And there are lip glosses. I'm not a huge fan, but hey. They're freaking cute. And these super cute glitters. Oh my goodness. And a more like natural berry kind of blush color. And then this is the eyeshadow palette. It's really cute. Soft pinks and peaches. Oh, for my knees again. Um, so there is a whole lot of new pixie stuff here. They did some collaborations with influencers. So, oh, and stickers. This is the one they did with Tina Yong, who I love. She's such a sweetheart. That's her on the back there. She's so cool. She's an Aussie living in Singapore, I think she is at the moment. Um, heaps of cool eyeshadow colors and then we have this collaboration with Promise and that is a sculpting palette highlight and contour kind of vibes and then this one is by Makeup by Denise it's a beautiful beautiful highlight kind of vibe palette it says glow shades on my skin tone I could probably use some of them as blush too and then this one is by Louise Rowe and it is like a cream lip and cheek palette. Oh my god, you guys don't understand how much cold pop stuff there is right here. It's like actually redonkulous. Here's some here. And another box this full. I'm gonna open some and just show you some favorites because there's just too much. Literally, like, I guess these are all of the collections in this box. It's good though that they're sending them all together rather than in a million different boxes, but holy moly. All right, it's heaps of like Christmas items. So I'm assuming they might still have some. We have a lippy pencil vault. A Lux of the Party Lux Lip Vault, Mood Melts Bath Soaks, the little body or face melts I should say, a really cute lash kit, oh my gosh, that's so cool with that. And there's also this huge palette gift set with heaps of their palettes on the inside, so that's such a good gift to someone. I'm going to put that in a giveaway. Something else to my P.O. box from this brand called Slinky. And they are 100% pure luxury silk pillowcases. And silk pillowcases are bomb because they're way more gentle on your hair. So I'm so excited to try these. At Slinky Silk. SlinkySilk.com. Here's how they look. Oh my gosh, they're so soft. We have some new Revolution makeup, so lip glosses here. Oh wow, it's like a silvery white and it's actually got a mirror on the side, that's so cool. And then also just a clear one too. Clear lip glosses are like the rage at the moment, it's so random. And then their eyeshadow palette is the XX Revolution Lights On. I'm gonna open this real careful because last time it broke all over me. Oh my god, it's got a light up mirror on it, look. The mirror lights up on either side. Can you actually see what I mean? Like down there, their lights are off and they're on and they're off and they're on. That's so cool. How fancy. Wine Not Collection by Colpop. I'll just show you the eyeshadow palette. Wine and Only. Looks like that. Vampy Berry Tones. Kind of boring. I feel like it's been done so many times. Dermalogica, one of my faves. And there is a gift here with my name on this. Let's read it. Happy Holidays. Dear Shannon, thank you so much for your ongoing support throughout 2020. We hope you love this small token of our appreciation. Thank you guys so much. I'm cute. It's like a little um platter plate. It says party on it. It's so nice of you guys. Thank you so much. I love Demologica. It's one of my favorites. And then last but not least, we have a bunch more White Fox Boutique stuff. Look how cute this is, you guys. 
So cute. The box. Oh, hi, Shannon. Summer has arrived, and we want you to be looking at your best. We can't wait to see you in our new pieces and hope you love it as much as we do. My little cute bikinis. Oh my gosh, bless. Look how cute they are. I love the pattern. They're so girly. Oh my god, the bottoms are even cuter. Cute. By the way, these are a size large. They just aren't really tight. <laughs> and cute little like sarongs. Oh my god, I die. And then these really cute like spotty patterns as well. Oh my gosh, I'm just going to take them straight to my beach house because that's where I'm going to swim. Made in heaven hoodie. Look at that. Super cute cherub hoodie as well. And... Another one. This is the last one, guys. More workout gear. So cute. I actually really like their workout gear. It's really comfy. Oh my god, cute. Look at those. Bike shorts made in heaven. And I was wearing a pair of these earlier today. They're shorts. They're so comfy. Super cute oversized t-shirt. And some trackies. Which I have so many pairs of White Fox Boutique trackies, so I might gift these to one of my friends because she'll find those comfy. Alright guys, that's everything. Make sure you enter the giveaway in the down bar. Check the down bar to see how you can win. And I will chat to you guys in my next video, which will be a full face of me trying out heaps of the stuff from today. I'm so excited. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>